Thank you, Claudine. And we have an update this afternoon on a Hurdle Avenue business shut down over the weekend for allegedly operating as a speakeasy. Most Buffalo's Dave McKinley spoke with the police commissioner about why it was able to reopen. Hi, Dave. Hi there, Lauren. Of course, we're talking about what appears from the outside to be a party planning business operating out of a storefront on Hurdle Avenue just east of Starin. This is occasions, but police said they had the occasion to observe a large crowd gathered outside of the business around 2.30 Saturday morning. According to police, they later discovered it was being operated without a license and accused its owner of employing an unregistered bouncer and allowing patrons to possess and consume alcohol, among other ordinance violations. They ordered a directive to cease all operations, which has since been lifted. Uh, they are certainly aware that if there are any other violations, we will come at them again and look at possibly pulling their even their regular business permit. What was going on in the place? Uh, they alleged some kind of, uh, uh, there was like a private party. Mm -hmm. It's not a place where you can serve booze. It's a business. It's not your home where you're having a birthday party or some other gathering. We did go back to the scene today to see if anyone there would talk to us. There was no one there when we visited, and it appeared there hasn't been much sort of party planning activity inside either. Coming up at 5, how prevalent are these speakeasies in Buffalo and how do police deal with them? On your side in the newsroom, Dave McKinley, Channel 2 News.